What's up, what's up, what's up? Wednesday, March 22nd. I want to talk. I want to talk to my veterans. I want to talk to my veterans, man. Uh, you know, if you ever served in the military, whatever branch you were in, I want to tell you and let you know from, a, you know, veteran to veteran, your brother right here, that if you ever served in the military, you know, whether it was four years, you did one contract, you did 20 years, uh, you know, me, myself, I did 11 years, 11 years of my life, I, uh, I served my country, I served our country, right, because if you're in the U.S., it's our country, right, and 11 years, and you know, my, my, my thing is, if you served and you are now out, you got no excuses, no excuses to be really, really making things happen out here in the civilian sector. Like, you have all the opportunities. Everything is lined up for you. Like, you should not have no excuses whatsoever to be really making things happen for you, your family, um, you know, uh, uh, accompli accomplishing goals, tackling every thing that you want to do, getting it done, crossing things off your bucket list. Like, if you are a veteran, the world is yours, my friend. The world is yours. Right, so I want to make sure that I'm talking to my veterans. You know, if you are struggling right now, if you're you're having a difficult time, open your eyes right now and consider the fact that you served your country. Yes, there may be some places that are going to be tougher to you know get in the door, but that's okay. I mean got to do it. I'm not saying, you know, life is easy after you get out. But there is nothing that you can't do out here. There's nothing that you can't have after having served in the military for your country. I was telling a friend of mine, I was like, yo, any veteran right now, any veteran that has, has served in the military, yo, you, we have no excuses. Once being out of the military, at least if this is your, if this is you know, a, a, a goal of yours. You have no reason, no excuse not to be a millionaire, not to hit a million. Five years after getting out, 10 years after, I mean, however long, if, that, if, that's, if that's a goal of yours, it is very attainable, very attainable. You could touch a million, many ways, having served in the military. I promise you that. I promise you that. All right, so get your ass up. Recognize that you served your country. Recognize that everything out here is what you fought for, is what you put your life on the line for. And, and, and go get it. It's that simple. It's that simple. Everything out here is for you. It's for the taking. It's so much. It's. We're going through a recession. We're going through inflation. Whatever. However you want to put it. The news is saying this. Media is saying that, All that stuff. But weekend comes. You still going out to the bars. You still going out to drink. You still, you know, if you're single, you taking so-and-so out on a date. You doing this. You going to restaurants. You know what I'm saying? I know people are talking about they don't got no money. But, you know, they, they spending on, on frivolous things. You know, so... If you out here and you're a veteran, served your country honorably, world is yours, my friend. I don't know how else to put it. Go out and get it.